comes this magic you tutorial for starting a new show with dimmers. First of all, we're going to open Magic Q by going to Start, Programs, Camsys Magic Q, Camsys Magic Q PC. We're then going to do Continue Last Show. This has now opened Magic Q. We're going to go to Setup and we're going to go New Show. Raise from the current show from memory and select a mode. We're going to choose normal mode. Magic Q has now cleared all of the data from the console. So if I go to the patch window, the patch will have nothing in it. I can then go and select choose dimmer or media. Here I get some common options. I'm going to choose generic dimmer. You'll see in the title bar that it says it's generic demo. It tells me the first free channel that I can patch to. I'm going to go and patch it. And I'm going to select the number of demos I want, which is 44. And then tell Magic Q where I want them. Universe 1 and Channel 1. Press Enter. Magic Q asks me whether I want to put them into vi Visualizer. Say yes. Magic has now patched 44 dimmers. So open the visualizer window so we can see what we're doing. I can then test each fixture by going and clicking on test the cursor head. I can also go into a test mode, hit test, and now as I cursor up and down, I can test the different fixtures as they are patched. So I can go up through all of my fixtures. You can go and change the name. So for example, if I wanted to call that front, I could type in front on the keyboard. And to also go to the intensity window. Here I have view of all the different faders, I can go and select those individually. Now we'll close the intensity window and select intensities from the keypad. I can type 1 at full on the keypad and this will set head 1 at 100%. I can also type 1 through 4 at full, and this will set heads 1 to 4 at 100%. When I type on the keypad, you'll see that the text appears in the status window, so you can see what you're typing. So in this case, I'm going to set at 50%. So that's the use of dimmers. For further info, please visit www.camsys.co.uk.